Hey YouTube, Matches860. It's a first for me, I'm on my third video today. Smoking a corn cob with gentleman collars in it. Just watched uh, Daily Puffer's video, Bruno. With this tin of uh, Dunhill's My Mixture 965. And I have mine from 1999. You can see there's still a seal on it. He did a great job of uh, describing about the Dunhill tobaccos and how they were outsourced. Interesting history. I'm not going to smoke this right now, but I'm going to crack it open. sort of give you a little background about uh, me and 965. Better get my tool. Do that right. Wow, I can smell it already. 965 was my first introduction to real pipe tobacco. Because I had been smoking vanilla Cavendish for so many years it was ridiculous. And not only was it my first introduction into real tobacco, obviously it was the first time I ever tasted uh, Latakia and I didn't know what that smell was but I had to find out because I knew I liked it uh, I'm going to open this up so you can see it just like Bruno did That is heaven. And he described uh, what the smell reminded him of. And I'll tell you what struck me the first time I ever opened a tin of this. Um, growing up outside of Boston, uh, several times during elementary school, And whenever we would have um, company from out of state, uh, there'd be a trip into Boston. And one of the places we'd go would be the uh, USS Constitution, which briefly, for anyone who's not familiar with it, it was the first American warship that was built in the 1700s and uh, awful lot of history behind it. Uh, when you board the ship, um, this odor of uh, timber and all the rope that's used for the rigging, I guess it's the smell of the hemp, 
is just overpower and uh, that's what this reminds me of so that's my little story on that wanted to take a minute before my neighbor cuts his lawn Bruno mentioned uh, the Moby Dick book and I thought he might get a kick out of seeing my edition of it from 1931 it was my mom's uh, given to her by her dad. She must have been a teenager when she got it. It has a nice illustration inside. And she, in turn, gave it to me in 1997 on my birthday. So I was very, very happy to get this. And uh, definitely a good read if you ever get a chance. Um, whaling, of course, is a big new or was a big New England industry, and uh, great book. So, uh, at some point, I'll smoke this stuff and uh, give you my impressions. Thanks for watching.